This is tutorial number five in a series of five tutorials where we've learned how to import Photoshop files, work with layer parenting, animate with motion tweens and graphic symbols. We have met the asset warp tool and our video is finally done and ready to export as a video file. And we want to upload it to our social media channels. And a very perfect format for that is to export out as an MP4 file. So when I want to export out, I go to file, export, and then export video. When you want to export out as a movie, it will give you an SWF file, a shockwave flash file, but I want to have an MP4 file in the end. So I'm gonna go for file export video. And in here, I'm gonna double check the size. It's 1080 width, 1080 height, exactly the same as I started with. So that's perfect. And the option to convert it into the media encoder is enabled. And that will actually give me the MP4 file. I can browse to the select, to the location where I want to save it. And that's in my robot folder. So that's perfect. And I'll just export out the video. And that will render a high quality video file at first. So a huge file size. But in the end, this file will be converted in the media encoder into an MP4 file. So that's perfect for now. Export. It will render the video and open the media encoder and will give you the media encoder queue. In here, my file is, uh, is already waiting and I want to convert it into an MP4 file. And for that reason, I will need to select the H264 and that will actually give me an MP4 file. I'm gonna leave the custom settings as it is. That was perfect already. And when I scroll over to this end, we can see, we can check if it's an MP4 file. And that's exactly what it says. So let's start the render queue, select the blue text over here, and that will give me my final video file. So this is our little character, originally designed in Photoshop, animated in Adobe Animate CC, and exported out as an MP4 file.